Hey guys, it's just me and Stace. I am back today with another Cricut video. We are also doing our Make It On Monday project and today we are making this really cute sailboat card. There's the outside there and then we have the inside. I just go to the computer and we will get started. All right, at the computer you want to go to design.cricut.com. You will see this screen. Enter in your email and your password. Click on sign in. On this screen we're going to go down until we get to the card category and then click on view all. In the search box in the upper right hand corner, type in the word a sailboat and then click on enter. It'll bring up this sailboat card. If you click on that, you will see it brings up your preview window and click on customize. Alright, so we have the card and the envelope. I'm going to click on the envelope and move that out of my way. On the card base, I'm going to right click on that and choose ungroup and bring this piece down, which is the base for the card. Now I am using a blue color cardstock, so I do want to create a mat for the inside. Left hand side toolbar, I'm going to click on shapes. I'm going to click on the circle. Have the circle selected. Top toolbar with the sizes. I'm going to leave the lock locked and change the height and make this be 4.25. I'm also going to change the color of that. And make that be white. Now when I bring this over, you can see it fits on the inside of the card really nicely. I also want to add text to that piece. Left hand side toolbar, I'm going to click on the T for text. Now I'm going to type in thanks for keeping me afloat. That will be a fun message for the inside of a card. So I'm going to go ahead and click on my text box. On the very top, I'm going to click on the alignment button and then change that from left to center. I'm going to click here where the font is. On the very far right hand side, I'm going to click on filter. Go down and click on writing. And the one I chose is called awesome. I'm going to scroll down until I get to that one, which is right here. You'll see the font change. Now I'm just going to resize it to fit inside that white piece. A little bit smaller. All right, so I think that looks pretty good. I'm going to go ahead and click on the text, hold down shift on my keyboard, click on the circle. The very top toolbar again, we're going to click on a line, click on a center. I'm going to right click on it and then choose attach. So you will need the Cricut marker to add that text to that box there. I right, upper right hand corner, go ahead and click on make it. So we have the insert for the card and again you'll need the marker, the outside of the card, the gray for the inside or the outside sailboat, the base of the card, the envelope, and the other piece of the sailboat. I'm going to click on continue, cut it out, go to the table and put our card together. Alright guys, we are back. We have all of our card pieces. I'm first going to work on the envelope. Just finger press all the score marks first just to get them started. Then take your bone folder and give them a better crease. Okay, so I'm going to fold my flaps in, fold this in, grab my glue. I'm using Art Glitter Glue. I get it from MamieMadeIt.com. Just put a little bit of glue on the flap here. And then close that up. Okay, we can set that aside. Our envelope is done. All right, now we have the card base. Fold that in half. All right, we're going to work on the inside of the card. So we have our little message here. Thanks for keeping me afloat. Of course, you can add any message you like. I'm going to put this in the center, just like that. Then we have the heart that cut out from the sailboat for the front. I'm going to go use that for the inside as like a little embellishment just to bring some of the inside of the card or some of the outside of the card to the inside. All right, so the inside of the card is done. I'm going to lay this flat and grab these pieces here. Now there are two pieces for the outer side. I'm just going to go ahead and take my art glitter glue and just go all the way across. All these pieces here. Okay, and then just line it up. Just try to make sure the boat is somewhat straight. If he hangs off a little bit here and there, we can fix them. Okay, now we have the bottom piece. So I think it looks pretty good. I'm going to flip it over. Now you can see I have a little bit of edge here, so I'm going to take my scissors and just cut that off right there. It's kind of hard to get it perfectly lined up and 
I'm okay with trimming it a little bit here and there. Okay, so now we have that. Take our blue piece. It's a really simple card. You can use this for an invitation to go for like a boat ride if you want to. Great for like a pool party kind of thing. All kinds of things you can use it for. Or just a simple thank you card. All right, so this piece, I'm gonna pop up. It is cut to fit one away, so I wanna make sure I flip on the wrong side. Grab my little foam square. So I'm just gonna use three, I think that's plenty for this. Just to lift it up and give it that little bit of a shadow. And we have that too on top. And the colors I used, I used um, Stampin' Up! colors. This is Coastal Cabana. The blue is Night of Navy, and the gray is Gray Granite. Isn't that a cute little card, though? Love that. I love the message as well. All right, so take the envelope and go ahead and pop that in there. It might be kind of snug at first. There we go, but it'll go in there. Then you close the flap, and you have a really cute... Um, a card to give to somebody or like I said an invitation as well. Alright guys there you have it our Make It Now Monday project a really fun and easy sailboat card. Any questions at all please let me know. As always thanks so much for watching have a great day and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.